In the year 2125, the entire world had become consumed by a virtual reality called Elysium. It was a breathtaking landscape, free from the monotony and pain of the physical world. People lived infinite lives within its digital walls, where happiness and success were only a few clicks away. But there was a small group of individuals who called themselves the disconnected who rejected this augmented existence. Led by a man named Ethan, the disconnected chose to unplug themselves from Elysium. They yearned for something tangible, something real. They craved the warmth of the sun on their faces, the smell of flowers, and the taste of a home-cooked meal. They believed that the digital realm was a mere imitation of the true world. As the disconnected navigated their new reality, they realized that the physical world was unfamiliar, dangerous, and ever-changing. It seemed that nature itself had awakened to its revenge against humanity's abandonment. The once vibrant forests turned into untamed jungles, and the seas became chaotic tempests that swallowed islands whole. Their leader, Ethan, couldn't help but wonder if their decision to leave Elysium had been a mistake after all. He agonized over the meaning of reality, wondering if the virtual world was as deceptive as the physical one. Amidst his search for answers, he met Sophia, a mysterious woman who seemed to possess an uncanny understanding of the true nature of existence. Sophia revealed that the physical world around them was no different from the digital realm. She spoke of a deeper consciousness, a collective dream of humanity that both the virtual and physical worlds were a part of. Reality is not confined to a single realm, she whispered, her voice carrying the weight of countless generations. Ethan and the disconnected began to question everything once again. How could they find their place in a reality that seemed fleeting and ephemeral? Sophia guided them through the remnants of the old world, remnants scattered amidst the chaos, to uncover the truth hidden within their own shared dream. In a mind-bending revelation, they discovered that the lines between the digital and physical worlds had blurred to the point of non-existence. Elysium was not an escape but an alternative expression of life itself. It was a shared creation of their collective dreams, and in ceasing to be disconnected, Ethan and the others realized that true reality wasn't defined by the medium but by the connections formed within it. With this newfound understanding, the disconnected decided to re-enter Elysium, not as a haven to hide from the physical world, but as a place to explore the depths of human experience. Armed with the knowledge that their existence was deeply intertwined with both the virtual and physical realms, they resolved to bring harmony between the two. Their return to Elysium sparked a revolution that transcended the boundaries of reality. As they encouraged the inhabitants of the virtual world to rediscover the embodied beauty of the physical, people began to remember the importance of the tangible. Elysium metamorphosed into a sanctuary where dreams and nature coexisted, forever linked through the bonds of love and exploration. In the end, the disconnected realized that true reality wasn't confined to any particular realm, but rather, it was the ever-evolving interplay between the virtual, the physical, and the ethereal aspects of human existence. And in that realization, they found their purpose as guardians of unity and custodians of dreams, embracing the profound beauty of what it truly meant to be alive.